the internet for all that. There we go. All right, so we're uh, starting off where we left off yesterday. Still working on that far left corner panel.
Oh. We were going to have pepperoni pizza, uh, pepperoni chicken strips. Okay. It's the Cody. You pulverize the pepperoni, mix it with the uh, breadcrumbs, and you put... Marshmallow's gone. <laughs> but you you use that as your Cody. So you have pe pepperoni pizza, uh, pepperoni chicken strips. Well, Albertsons isn't that far away, or you can do something else. Oh, I know what I forgot.
Hey, Rune! Nice to see ya! Yeah, Rune's from, uh... Well, I don't know where all Rune hangs out, but I do know that Rune tends to hang out a lot in Spooner Sloth's channel. Nice to have ya. Nice to have somebody to talk to. Besides the glass. <laughs> My wife's off making dinner, so I can't talk to her. Oh, okay. Well, just to explain what I'm doing right now, I am foiling this uh, piece in copper foil. Um, in fact, all the pieces get foiled in copper foil. And then, uh, once all the pieces are cut and foiled, then you solder it all together. And the solder is really the backbone that holds everything together. I will. I gotta finish what I'm doing. I really have to finish what I'm doing. I'm almost done with this piece anyway. So. Cool. Well, I appreciate you dropping by. Lord knows I could use the viewers. Even if it's just for a little while, I appreciate the support. Alrighty, so uh, the, because of the color, unless I get it in the light, when it's in the light, you can see the copper really good, but it is hard to see um, the copper because of the orange color. It's a little more evident um, on this piece. Now, just to give you a backstory, what happened is I was working on the panels up here, these three panels up here. And uh, I was leaning on this one, and it cracked. Well, instead of throwing it away, I decided to uh, go ahead and grind the sharp edges off and use what nature gave me for a cool effect. Instead of having just a plain panel, now you've got the crack designs plus the, the uh, color design on the glass. <laughs> I know, right? So let me uh, pull myself some slack here. And so I did the same thing on this side. Um, this time, this side was on purpose because I'd already done it over here. Um, as you can see, this side broke into many, many more pieces. Um, so many, in fact, uh, as you can see, I've numbered them <laughs> just so I can keep them straight. Yeah, I know. It gives a really unique effect. What I'm kind of hoping it'll look like when it's done, and that piece that's hanging out up there is the one that belongs in this uh, center spot. But when this is done, I'm hoping that it kind of looks, because of the cracks, like the sloth head is popping out of the ground or shattering reality or, or something. Yeah, yeah. Well, the color's nice, and then the then the cracked effect makes it uh, look all the more interesting. So right now, uh, I am foiling the pieces that have already been ground down. I've got uh, several pieces that I have got to grind here in a minute. This is actually the last piece that is uh, foil ready. Hey, MPS! Nice to see ya! Oop, as I knock my camera all over the place. Yeah, I think Rune's saying hi to MPS, I'm pretty sure. Because that looks like a hot hello emote if I've ever seen one. Oh, I have two 
guests in channel. I don't know what to do. Now, really, I was just explaining that to my wife. She's very new to Twitch still, so she and she's trying to cook at the same time. And read my chat for me, although while I'm while I'm in foiling mode, it's a little easier. Um, but again, Impius, since you just missed it, what I'm doing right now is uh, foiling all of the uh, little glass shards in copper foil. All the pieces get covered in copper foil, and then at the end, you 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 uh, brush on flux onto the uh, copper and you solder it together and that's what holds everything in place and keeps it from falling to pieces keeps it from turning into a Patsy Cline song the delay is I'm sorry Hmm. Well, we're only dropping 0.7% of frames, so I don't know. Maybe tr Twitch is having an issue? Okay. Well, it it has been me before, and I do have to uh, watch for it because sometimes my uh, internet decides to take a dump. Okay, my wife confirmed what her delay is on the phone. How's the volume? Is it is it good? Yeah. That's good. If it's clipping, let me know. I ha every once in a while, I even though I never change the settings unless unless I'm unless somebody tells me I'm clipping or something. Um, every once in a while, I have to change it because someone will come in and tell me I'm. Oh, good, 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 good. Right. Well, yeah, it would cause a weird echo probably. Even though I've got a noise gate on, I probably don't have it set perfectly because I really don't know what I'm doing. As far as the uh, OBS stuff goes, I, I really, I just wing it. That's what I said. I said I wing it. Oh, oh, I didn't hear that back there. That's okay. That's fine, dear. Really? Oh, uh, just so you know, uh, when I reach the glass kind of behind the microphone, uh, or the camera. I've got a little bowl of water here. I uh, I didn't have any paper on them, so I didn't rinse them off. Uh, but that's what that bowl of water is for, because after you grind it, it leaves uh, little particles of glass sticking to the edge. And if you don't uh, just give at least the edges a little bath before you try to foil it, the foil won't stick. It's like trying to stick scotch tape on a uh, on a dirty table.
Also, full disclosure, uh, I've always been a little bit of an absent-minded professor, <laughs> so if you uh, see me searching around on my work area for something I've slightly misplaced, it happens all the time, don't worry. <laughs> it's completely normal, at least for me. And it's not like it's something that will get better with old age. I'm sure it only will <laughs> get worse. <laughs> Ooh, yummy. That actually does sound good. I love kale. My favorite soup in the world comes from Olive Garden, and it's got kale in it. Zupa Toscana. Well, what, my problem is, is I'll move it like six inches and then I can't find it. <laughs> Literally, six inches makes all the difference in the world. But you know what they say. If you have a messy work area, that means you have to have an organized mind. Yeah, right. Mine's organized. It's just forgetful. Yep. I have no idea if my wife is coming through. Sometimes I'm answering her. <laughs> like it, like that little yep was actually answering my wife. That's 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 almost as bad as me. I I had my glasses sitting on top of my head and I don't wear glasses ever for anything. <laughs> but I, I did that thing where you forget your glasses is on your head. Yeah. Can you hear me? Hmm? He says he can hear me a bit. A bit, but not like a lot. way away from the microphone because the microphone's here on my face but the pickup on this thing is just incredibly good to be honest and these are just logitech wireless headphones with the little plug-in that plugs into the computer like the uh, wireless mice hey bunny want to see a bunny I'm being attacked. Being it's attacked. a bunny. Red eyes, white dragon, rabbit is attacking me. <laughs> She's waiting until I least suspect it, and then she'll chew my ankles off. Yeah, no, they really are, uh, especially for the price. I think we paid what thirty bucks. Um, 40, 30, okay, forty bucks. Yeah, she has a cage, but in the afternoon, a lot of times we let her run run loose for a bit. All right, so a lot of these small pieces still need to be ground, at least on one side. So that's what we're going to be doing here in a minute. I'm going to set the uh, camera up. If I can get the table to let go of the cord. That ought to be good. Uh, noise. Okay. My wife's on it. <clears throat> mm. 
it's just a very very light grind I'm doing on these pieces literally just enough to take the sharp edges off because since they were broken from each other they fit each other really well and uh, I don't want to lose too much of uh, that tightness that I already have <clears throat> little gaps are okay but uh, big gaps can cause issues, especially once you start to solder. <laughs> oh, I didn't have any gap issues when I was soldering. I had other issues, but not gap issues. Just out of curiosity, Rune, how loud is that grinder when it comes through? Like, because I have no idea. I just put the noise disclaimer because I was afraid it was going to be, like, really bad. <laughs> so, yeah, it never hurts to have a noise command. Yeah, I see. Why won't it let you say rabbit? I don't know. I don't have any uh, banned words. And it came through on my end. I don't know. I'm being attacked again. It's going to bite my butt. Okay, not really. I'm not scared of the rabbit. I just think it's funny. She's a very adventurous rabbit. Got tons of personality, which is awesome. Awesome, awesome. I got him today. I'm here next week. Oh, he's here next week. Okay. He's here next week. So he's been he's been home for now going on three weeks, and next week will be four weeks. Unless it's something on the stream elements bot, but I don't think so. I mean, it's just rabbit. I don't know. Because it came, the first time you said rabbit, it came through. And then the next thing I got from you after the uh, okay sign was the why won't it let me say rabbit? So I don't know. Were you putting a period in, in, in too close to a word and it thought it was a link? But I, I, I don't see that. Not on the, uh, not on the, um, what used to be the Ankbot side of things. I don't have my Twitch up. Alright, All right, let me go into uh, into Twitch. Go into my channel and turn the sound off. Because we don't need that echo. It went through that time. I'm going to keep monitoring it, Rune, uh, see if it happens again, and then uh, maybe if it happens again, uh, I'll see if I can fix it. But I'm, I'm on the chat room now, so if it happens again, I'll, I'll see, I'll try to see where the... Uh,
where the hiccup is. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Hmm. That's weird. It did it again, but I don't know, like, why, why it's, it must be something about bunnies, but why? <laughs> I, I don't know. I'm going to have to look at my Twitch settings, like, very carefully. I allowed it, so, uh, if it does it again, I'm just going <laughs> to keep an eye on it. Oh, yeah, it was on the Twitch side, okay, because I see in, in my chat, it says, thank you for your feedback. So, I, 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 I don't know why it flagged that message. There was absolutely nothing wrong with it. Stupid Twitch. I do have my moderation set th to the highest setting just because um, I don't, other than my wife, I don't really have a, a mod right now. And, you know, just in case someone comes in here and wants to be nasty, hopefully Twitch will catch it for me, especially if I'm busy. But I figure once once I get a little bigger and have a few followers and maybe get a, a real mod, no offense to my wife, um, but I can turn the, the Twitch moderation off. But that's what it was. It was the automatic Twitch moderation that flagged it for whatever weird reason. I don't know, Rune, I guess Twitch thought you were talking about Playboy bunnies or something. But yeah, like I said, Rooney, it was really just a temporary precaution. I could probably turn it off anyway. <laughs> I'm doing good to get uh, one or two guests in here per session. Although um, that's enough with my wife and stepson watching that hopefully I can make affiliate by the end of the month. That's kind of my goal um, so I can get bits and stuff. But, 
but yeah, I might just turn that off anyway, because that's, that's dumb. And a lot of that was set up before I had actually streamed, so I didn't know what my experience was going to be. I didn't know how much protection I needed, so I went kind of maybe overboard a little bit. Well, I probably would forget to turn it back on, but I think the point I'm trying to make is I don't think I actually need it. If I would quit losing my trash down there, that'd be great. <laughs> right in my lap. It'll get here when it gets here. Yeah, they probably actually would like that idea. Oh, uh, the bunny, the bunny's name is Red Eyes White Dragon Rabbit. My son, he's seven, and he does have learning issues. Um, and he wanted to name her Red Eyes because she's albino. She's got the red eyes. And I was like, that's a horrible name for Rabbit. I suggested trying to be funny that um, we name her Dragon so that he could uh, go to school and boast about his pet Dragon. Uh, last time I saw her, she went that way under the couch. And... And so, my stepson, he's 24, he added the white, so it became Red Eyes White Dragon, and then I don't know who added the rabbit, so that, okay, my, my youngest and my wife added the, the rabbit to the end of the name, so it's Red, Red Eyes White Dragon Rabbit is the official name of the bunny. <laughs> yeah, or or her nickname, Bunny Foo Foo. <laughs> it is cute, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. <laughs> And, and and part of part of part of my thing was also a, a little underhanded tribute to Monty Python, of course, the killer rabbit, you know. So the the dragon part, as well as the the cool factor. Actually, uh, we got raided, and of course, my internet died at the same time. But uh, I'm gonna have to record a video because my raid response was "Deploy Red Eyes White Dragon," and. My uh, seven-year-old held her above the couch, and I turned the camera around to watch her, and, it, and they made raw noises. It was just awesome. <laughs> oh, gee, <you're> right. <laughs> 
it was just awesome. So I, I need to get that recorded, and that's going to be my official raid response. Right, well, the Muxy link is so they get credit in channel. If they want to do it anonymously, they can click the other link. That was the whole idea. I mean, I'll know who it is. Dude, it'd be more like the Monty Python rabbit if you feed it, it red raspberries. Um, we don't know. She goes crazy for lettuce and sour right now. Yeah, right now her 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 like food fetish is lettuce and celery. Like seriously, store bought iceberg lettuce. Which, I mean, yeah, it's a rabbit. She'll eat it. It's not the most nutritious thing on the planet. Like, there's not much to it. It's mostly water, but she loves it. And of course, celery. You know. It looked like it ate someone. <laughs> yes. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, every time we hold her, she kind of nibbles at our clothes. Not not in a bad way, like, she just is nibbly. She's behind me at the moment. Oh, good. Yep. Oh, yeah, I heard paper, paper rustle back there. Yep, that's how I know where she is. Russell, Russell, Russell. I know the rabbits we had at school loved dried, dried cranberries as treats. We'll have to try that. That, that. I mean, that's a great idea. It's just not anything we had thought of yet. Uh, should have named her Nibbles. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nibbler, like uh, tribute to Futurama, maybe? Where's your little? I, was looking for my I don't know about no. Ugh. My posts and pads. Right. I can get my pen to work. I have cranberries. That'll be something we're looking to do. Mm-hmm. I know where she's hanging out, too. She's hanging out in that corner, and nope. Oh no, she isn't. She's hanging out in the other corner. <laughs> and normally she hangs up. There's this little corner where we have a whole bunch of those fold up canvas chairs. Normally she hangs out there. Yeah, I would believe that. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, shoot, he said it earlier. Uh, I'm, looking, I'm, looking, I'm, looking. I'm scrolling. I'm scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. I it was long, long at the beginning. Okay, this is Origins. 
Origins. Thank you. Oh, Assassin's Creed Origins. Yes, yes. I, I, it's like once you, once you said Origins, it's like yes, that's what, that's what Rune said. My wife wants to know what system rune. I was kind of assuming PC, but... Because I know Origins didn't take that long for Danny to download it. And I don't remember which one you had to download the full demo on. I think the... Okay, the Xbox is out here, so it's being a PS. Uh, I'm update the Origins launcher so I can get the Sims pet to... Okay. Oh, I think I forgot to. How'd you forget? I forgot to bathe that one. Oops. Was not, not really. And just, uh, just so you know, the sharpie like comes right off. I don't even have to try. <laughs> Just... the... Yep. Hang on. Uh, where is it? There it is. The problem is, is there's no overlays that fit what I do because I move the camera all the time, so... I basically picked this one because I like the uh, the p particular shade of blue, blue green. Yep. Mm-hmm. Boys. Ah.
Yeah, uh, <laughs> I have that in chat for a reason. Like, I'm being pretty good right now, but if I get to where I'm cutting and grinding and cutting and grinding, sometimes I uh, have a hard time with uh, keeping up. Yeah, you do help, but it's not foolproof. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, sometimes when they're sick, the hardest part is getting them to eat. But that is definitely a good sign, returning to a normal or more normal appetite. Instead of Grandma getting run over by a reindeer, I just got run over by a bunny. She ran over my foot. Sometimes I wonder if we should have named her Speedy Gonzalez. She literally pops in from one, one end of the house to the other in just moments. You'd be like, I just saw you over in the kitchen. Well, if you're around long enough, Rune, I think we might actually get to some cutting tonight. Once I get the rest of these uh, s smaller, uh, lower set pieces set, uh, those upper pieces are separated because I'm going to have to uh, cut the tops off of them uh, so that they fit the sloth. Ooh. Will this piece of tape make it all the way around? That is a good question. If not, I'm going to set it to the side. I've got... We'll see. I don't know yet. It's going to be close. Close and no cigar. Like... About a half an inch, maybe three quarters of an inch short. So I'll set that to the side. Yes, rabbit. Blah. Yeah, that is hard to say. Uh, 
I guess the uh, best thing you can do is just keep monitoring it. That roll I just finished off, I used uh, on the previous project that I made, which I don't know if you've seen or not, Rune, but I do... Uh, I do post to Twitter and Instagram, so um, my Instagram username is the same as my Twitch username if you want to check it out if you're curious. It was the Fun King 3D logo. For uh, Fun King 3D. He's a, a 3D printing YouTuber. He says, I may try switching litter boxes. See if he likes the one from the other room better. It may be because it's brand new. It yeah, it's possible. Type of litter and it's smaller than his old one. And that has a lot to do with it. The size does have a lot to do with it. Uh, he's picky about food, so I think it's safe to assume his, he's picky about boxes as well. He yeah, cats can be. I don't follow you on Twitter. Gonna have to rectify that. Oh, thank you. No cake. I give you both the right amount of food. If you guys want cake, you're gonna have to eat what's on your plate. Because <laughs> he's already been through it once before. <laughs> yep. <laughs> well, that's because I'm sitting right in front of you now. Yeah, uh, she moved to the couch, which is. Right there. So I'm not surprised that she heard that. Instead of having a rabbit's foot, I have a rabbit's tail. <laughs> like I said, instead of having a rabbit's tail, I have a rabbit's tail. Or having a rabbit's foot, I have a rabbit's tail. Right, buddy poo poo? Yeah. 
Yep. The rabbit had a uh, incident the other night. She was out, and uh, Harold, the seven-year-old, forgot to look where he was going and stepped on her tail, and it came off. Well, yeah. Anyway, the bunny's doing fine. She's just... She just got her tail docked. Without seeing the vet. We were actually on the way to a doctor's appointment. We turned around and we came back. But by the time we came back, we, ex we looked at her and... There's no bleeding or whatever. She hops just fine. No muscle tremors or anything. So, meh. Mm-hmm. Yep. Like mom said, miss, I'm all over the house. Almost there. Oops. I'm at, uh. I'm not there yet. Nope. I'm a little ways from it yet. I got this one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven or so more pieces to go. It's just they're far enough over I can't reach them <laughs> from here.
Okay, that's fine. Uh, thank you for coming. Thank you for joining me. Uh, appreciate the company. You're welcome back anytime, Rune. I miss choking and I have bitter thoughts. Okay. Uh, chugging, dear. Yep, I hear you. Get my foot under here. Sit right so I'm not straining my back. Yes, it was. Crunchy, munchy, munchy, crunch. This is going to be the up, down, up, down, up, down game.
You heard mom. Hmm? No. Did you get so fast? I can't. So, I Do as mom says. Really? That's funny. <laughs> Does he ever?
Did you pestering her? That better be all you're doing. Okay. Gonna need a uh, noise command. Over here is my trash pile. All right, this is finally the last ready to foil piece, or well, it was mostly ready to foil. I just had to run the sharp edges off, and uh, here in just a moment, I'll decide which end I want to start on, and we'll be cutting some more glass.
Huh? All the ones that were ready to foil. All the rest of them need an edge or two cut off to match up with the rest of the pattern. Alrighty, and that piece actually sits somewhere in here, like that. So that's what we've got so far. All the pieces from here down are foiled. We just need to work on those top pieces. All right, this first one, I'm going to use a Sharpie. Because there's not much that I'm cutting off of it, just, just that little corner. Just gave myself a little score across there. Sorry, I'm in the light. There we go. Almost perfect. Just got to grind the top off a little bit, and that's perfect. Okay, noise command, please. Alrighty, that should do it for this piece.
It doesn't take much. Almost forgot. I gotta give the edges a little bath. And some water. And then wipe it off. Just to remove any particulates of glass that may have stuck to it from the grinding process. So that the copper, the uh, adhesive copper foil will properly stick to the glass. If I'm not careful, my headset will just slide right off my bald head.
seven or nine. Well, I will when I'm done. Like I'm not going to? I'm going to use the same technique here. Just trying to Eyeball that line as best I can. Usually I use a piece of paper to trace things, but that would be a lot of paper for a lead to trim. There you go. Sorry about that. My headphones fell off. I've been trying to avoid that all night. There we go. Get a gander here. That's pretty good. And we'll go over to the grinder and trim all the sharp edges off. You got the command?
dropped it into my little bowl of water. Dry it off in a second.
for you guys to look around if you're around. Make sure there's no problem with this. And you gave her that outfit? No, you gotta also figure out clothes for tomorrow. Okay, fine. You don't want to stick there? I'll get another piece in a second. Alrighty, as you can see, we've got a nice snug fit. 30 minutes, we might finish this time.
Noise command. Alrighty, I already dunked this one in the water and wiped it off. I want to see if this uh, scrap piece of foil is big enough. Did Bray get the thing back on? Did he get the cord back on? Yes. Okay. He was just trying to do his job.
keeps coming off. I, mean, I even clamped it, and it still came off. Well, that's because the ball on the end is squished. You need to cut that last ball on the end off. On the chain, the little balls. How is it squished? Just look at it. Harold, did your mother ask you to do something, please? Is that your rabbit or what? Oops. Sorry, forgot to move the camera. Got me for a noise?
window club? Oh yes, I keep forgetting. No, just for the last few pieces. I would, but they're annoying. They don't, uh, well, I mean, they work for the safety factor, but uh, they're not comfortable. And believe me, I can see a difference with them not being on. I can see better. No, my vision's so good that when I use them, <laughs> Well, they make a difference. Blurry's not necessarily the right word. It's just, you know how good my vision is. In fact, the plants where we were forced to wear safety glasses I always tried to make the argument that uh, they interfered with my inspection, because they did. They make me see worse. One nine one nine is military time. It's nineteen nineteen. I've got ten minutes. I think I can finish. I might go just a hair over just so I can finish. Or at least get close to it. We'll see how far I am. When the time comes.
Got me.